What's up guys welcome back to another video before we get into anything today i want to make sure if you guys haven't yet and you've been liking the videos make sure you hit the subscribe button down below we'd really appreciate it and give this video a thumbs up other than that let's get into the, what we got going on for today fortunately the duck hunting around us has been pretty tough recently we've had record highs like in the 70s even so that really hasn't pushed down a lot of ducks so that's made things quite difficult for us just low numbers of ducks which means there's a lot harder to shoot ducks if there's not many of them here. Another big problem we've been running into is with my school still going on, I got about a week left of school and David's been working and stuff. Uh, we don't have much time to go out. So the time we do go out, we choose to hunt instead of scout. And I think we've been learning somewhat of a lesson of the importance of scouting, especially when there's not as many birds in the area. There's not a whole lot of birds in the area. You really need to be exactly where they want to be to be able to have good hunts. And we just haven't been there. Fortunately, I'm about to hit winter break. And so I will have a lot more time to scout and hopefully get on some better hunts. And hopefully we eventually get some cold weather to push some more birds down. For today's video, I have some uh, several videos from last year of clips of us hunting of where we maybe shot one, two ducks or geese. And so I thought it'd be cool to throw those together, like maybe narrate, give you guys an idea of what was going on that day. Um, and just highlight how, you know, every time we go out and go duck hunting, it's not going to be good, but duck hunting, one day of duck hunting with one duck, two ducks or no ducks is always better than a day at school or work. So, um, with that being said, let's get into today's video. The first, few clips are from when we hunted last year around Christmas time. It was kind of a weird day. We got out for an afternoon hunt. Someone was in our spot we wanted. So we went somewhere else and then those guys left. So we moved, we shot some ducks there, but then they were working somewhere else and we moved there. It was a warm day, I think in the sixties and late December. So not a ton of ducks are flying. A few clips here. I hope you enjoy them. Also guys, make sure to comment down below how your hunting seasons are going. How did we miss that? Mm, we shot too late. Dude, come back. Come back. I only have one shot left. We suck. Ricky, we suck. Those are too far. Yeah. You ready? You ready? Yeah. Yo, yo, yo. Are these mallards? Are they? I got it. I got that Drake. Bro, did you not see that one fall? Yeah. Thank God. All right, guys, for this next clip, this is a really cool hunt. At this point in time, that was the biggest group of mallards uh, David and I had ever worked. It was a super cool hunt to be on. Um, the group did it perfectly. We were looking straight into the sun and... <laughs> As you might be able to tell here in a few seconds, uh, our shooting wasn't quite the best, but it was a great group of ducks to watch work um, and come in and definitely something that keeps gets your blood pumping and keeps you wanting to come back for more. Right over us. 
Now I got one right here. Is there not any out here? I don't drop them. I thought I did too. Alright guys, <clears throat> we, <coughs> excuse me, it's 824, so we've been here for shooting light for an hour and 20 minutes, um, we just got our first group to come in, <coughs> a big group of mallards that I, we were able to call in, worked us for a while, somehow we only hit one, so I don't know if it was just because we're shooting directly into the sun, um, that we missed or, or what because I also think that's the biggest group of aller mallards we've me or David has ever worked so we're also probably just really excited and just firing so hopefully we can get a couple more groups to come in like that uh, we had a group earlier kind of come in like that and then they flared um, so we put some more brush on these blinds you can see behind me to like break up the outline so hopefully we can get a few more groups to come in like that and that'd be awesome if we did so stay tuned all right this next clip <laughs> It was a crazy hunt, even though we had no idea what to expect. Uh, our buddy Michael works for a guy on a farm, has some fields, and it was during our duck split. We had done, we had scouted for geese, unable to get permission anywhere. None of us had anything to do, and we're like, you know what, let's just send it. We're going to set up our blinds, we're going to throw out the silhouette decoys and see if we can't get any geese to come in. Um, and we actually had a group come in pretty nicely and so you'll about to see that here it once again just like one of those fun moments that i'm gonna remember for a long time that although it wasn't the greatest hunt um it was still super fun don't move i'll call out here wait wait let him come let him come let him come let him, let him come hey david shoot left dan shoot me i'll shoot right all right should we shoot should we take him you know. I got one. I got one. Oh, I got. Th Good stuff, boys. Wait, that wait. one's hurt. One's hurt. I killed the far left one. Watch him. Oh, there's one right here. That's the one I shot. Oh yeah, good night. <laughs> <laughs> There's still three. Oh my god, they did it, didn't they? <laughs> what? Dude, let's go. Good stuff, boys. Let's go. Dude, Where are all of them? Wow. I don't, dude. Where did yours go? I hit them one and they sailed. just kept flying. Yeah, the one that I hit sailed. I'm like, the only one that killed one? Yeah, the yeah. one I hit, he he dropped and then sailed. This one freaking... That was weird, bro. <laughs> That's the first left one. I freaking hit him and he just like dropped. Good stuff. That was a nice group, bro. I don't know what the deal was. First goose down. They go haunt, daddy. These last two clips you guys are about to see, uh, two duck hunts. As the theme of this video and the reason the theme of this video is because it's reality of hunting but we just had one duck both these days and it's one of them was hunting a new spot we never hunted and so we still learned a lot about that spot but other than that i hope you guys enjoy these next few clips here i don't know if he's coming this way though <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 
That is a drop. <laughs> David will get him. Bro, <laughs> hurry oh up. Gosh. He ain't going anywhere, dude. Freak my lard, <laughs> And so there was one. And so there was one. Where is it? Oh. <laughs> nice shot. Good one. Alright guys, that is going to be it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I know it's a little different than what we've been putting out recently, but like I said, we just haven't been on great hunts and we wanted to share something with you guys this week. We appreciate all the views we've been getting recently, all the subscribers. Our goal is to hit 100 subscribers by the end of 2021. So we got about three weeks to do that. We really appreciate it. Like I said earlier, if you go down, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and uh, let us know if you enjoyed this style of video. Maybe sometime in the future, we can you know, maybe add a little more commentary to a hunt or something like that if you guys like. Once again, appreciate you watching. Hopefully hunting seasons are going well for you guys, and we'll catch you on the next one.